back with another one, Bad News Brown. And I want to speak a little bit about gentrification. Now, gentrification is nothing new. Dates back to the old Boys in the Hood movie. When that scene where, what was it, Trey Daddy was, was speaking out there in the hood about that billboard. And as we know, it takes place in every hood. It has taken place. It's took place. But anyway, I kind of want to speak on a conversation I overheard a little bit. I was walking into a store, a corner store, and the dude behind the counter was having a conversation with a kind of older lady. And she was... I overheard as I walked in, she was saying, I guess they was talking about real estate. And she was, I guess she was, I'm assuming that she was talking about buying property somewhere. I'm not sure what hood in the town, but it was obviously a hood in the city of Oakland. So she was basically saying, well, uh, the lady, she she's not sure she wants to buy that property because it's a bad neighborhood or whatever. Then the dude behind the counter, as I walk in the store and I'm heading to the back to where the sodas or whatever, he like, oh, don't worry, in uh, five years, you know, it'll be different. And that's what really hooked me when I heard the five years. So basically, they're already being told the plans and it's no secret if you in Oakland you go to the West Oakland Library upstairs they got plans and they serious about them plans y'all so that should prompt you to really start getting proactive and starting to determine what not only you need to do but what we need to do to not only, I don't want to say counter, but get involved, get ahead of it, lest you be wiped out. And another good example in another way is now in the city of Oakland, it ain't no, as we already know, the, the Raiders left, Warriors across the bay in Frisco. So now the A's is gone. Now, this is their last year, and I think it was today, they was doing a whole, um, what they call that, a, a reverse, what they call it, boycott or protest or whatever. So basically a lot of people, you know, of all groups, uh, residents of Oakland, people from here, homegrown, we, you know, we mad about that. And when they do that, it's really a wrap. And then I'm already hearing at the Coliseum, they didn't already sold it to a developer and they ain't going to turn them into condos that's official and from what i heard what i was told is going what is it three thousand units three hundred or three thousand units and maybe a small percentage ten percent or only a hundred units is going to be low income and the rest of course high up higher end Due to that's right by the airport and all that. So it's the changes is happening. So when that happened, it's really nothing. The culture of the city is gonna start shifting. And another crazy thing, if things go as they got planned, a lot of the hoods, neighborhoods that we from we claim, all that is gonna shift. Cause you gotta think a lot of the new generation. They not gonna be raised. This is why the cities like the Antiochs, the Pittsburghs, and even the Stocktons is turning up now. Cause already the the earlier uh migration away from, from cats out here from the bay and the town to moved out and abroad due to gentrification or higher prices. So it's already happening. So I can see like I said, if it goes as they got planned. 10, 20 years down the line, it's going to be whole new hoods. And I mean, I ain't even talking about the clicking up gang stuff. I'm talking about new hoods just because the, the area that changed. And we see in the examples right now 
right before our eyes. And again, going back to it's starting to get it's time to start getting proactive. And actually, in this one day, we got bad. Don't nobody want to network. Don't nobody want to work together. So, hey, well, the ones that do, we do. But, hey, you're going to be forced to in a minute. Let's get left behind or worse. But it's, it's really time to start doing that. Really time to start hooking up with certain folk who I don't even want to say in the know, but that's trying to do something because you can't work with everybody. It don't even matter. You can't trust everybody, but it's a method to the madness, man. And there's legitimate ways to do things across the board that we need to start tending to. And it's, you know, it's, it's just like that. And I just had to share that with y'all one time, man, because it's getting real, real out here again. Like I said, man, especially the black population Oakland man y'all and y'all better hold on tight because it's shifting it ain't ain't no more sports so none of the things we like to do culturally or even entertainment wise is being promoted and don't get me wrong we got first Friday and all that but that's all that is like secondary that should be secondary entertainment venues that shouldn't be the primary thing that your city got don't get me wrong it's it's lit it's litty you know i ain't taking away from that we got all kind of little things happening this week anyway for juneteenth or whatnot but still regardless like i said we we need to start thinking fast and thinking now now of course me personally i got plans and efforts is being made but again it ain't all about me it's all about us all of us and together we can achieve more so y'all tap in man and start networking man and do what y'all need to do to be a part of the changes that's going to occur because don't get me wrong change is part of life things change naturally so if you don't adjust or even if you don't even want to adjust and you want to keep certain things the same, you still got to be ahead of it. You got to have a strong foundational pull or, scent or stance in it all just to even refuse the change or go with the change or help direct the change that's inevitable going to happen. So that's all the type of, that's the type of hype we need to be on. And I know it's, this that square biz talk y'all don't like to hear, but this the things you need to know. So it's just like that, man. Bad news brown breaking this shit down. Go ahead and subscribe to me. Hit that like or dislike. Peace.